Hey, what is up you guys? Joshua D9000 and welcome back to Five Nights at Freddy's. So, um, in the last video, I attempted this night twice and failed both times. Today, I have tried to play this game so many times, but I have failed every single time. Um, I've, I've even lost track of what number attempt this is. So I actually went on YouTube and I looked up a strategy... And it was a strategy that I was not aware of. It's a little different from mine, and I think it might work. So basically what I'm doing is I'm checking the camera every single time. Because apparently there's a way to keep Freddy off the stage. To keep him on the stage, I should say. As well as Foxy, and that's just looking at the camera time and time again. We shall see if it works. Because Freddy is essentially the tough guy. Sounds simple enough, but it's not that easy because you gotta. This is a strategy that I was not aware of. And you also gotta check your lights. You also gotta listen for the sound cues. You also have to be quick because you don't want Bonnie or Chica stepping outside your door because when you pull up the camera, that's when they sneak in. You also gotta listen to sound cues too, so I hear them. You know when Freddy's on, his, on the run when... Of course, I'm not going as fast as the uh, video that I watched, but um, I'm still going fast. I guess we can check on Pirate's Cove in here in a little bit. Yep, okay, so Foxy's there. You should always check on Foxy a little bit. Just keep Freddy at bay as long as possible. And it looks like this strategy is actually working. This is the first time I've tried it. I literally just saw it on YouTube once. And it looks like it's effective. Maybe like once like every hour so I'll check on Foxy. <sighs> My mouse just keeps sliding off the table. A.M. Freddy's still on the stage. This is actually working. All right, Foxy's Foxy's peeking his head. Ah, uh, this is getting exhausting. Box is still on the stage. Oh my gosh, this is actually working. I'm so happy. We're not halfway through the night yet, but we're getting close. Right?
Now we're halfway through. All right, Bonnie. You need to go. All right, Foxy. Guys, we're at 3 a.m. Okay, come on, 4 a.m. Go to 4 a.m. This strategy is so much more effective than the previous. So much more. I wish I had looked this up sooner. And as you're putting the camera on Freddy, you'll always want to be... Um, you don't have to do it all the time, it doesn't look like it, but you have to keep checking Foxy. I hear the twitching. Freddy and Ch uh, Bonnie or Cheeker are nearby. I'm not going to check which one, because I'm, I'm already checking which one. Because as long as I'm switching between the camera quickly... There we go. Alright. Let me check on Foxy for a little bit. Alright. Freddy's on stage! Oh. Alright. I am in the zone. No security guards sleeping on the job at this place, that's for certain. Five AM and I'm at fifty percent. Fifteen percent. Foxy's on the move. Dang it, I forgot to put the back on Freddy. But I think that might be good enough. I forgot. I messed it up. I messed it up, but I think it might be good enough. Okay, hopefully I win this. If I don't win it, it's I can always try again. I can always try again. But I think there's a chance with this one. Okay, come on. Dang it. No. Freddy's gonna punish me. Ah. Yes! There we go, the strategy worked. All right. Oh boy, okay, okay. So, oh yay, I win. $120 for a whole week. Wow. I mean, I know for a fact that that, was not a, that would not have been enough money in 2014. Imagine 2024 in this economy with all the inflation. 
So yes, we did it. We got one star. Now we got night six. Um, you know what? You know what? Screw it. I'll give it a go. I'll give it a go. Since I beat night five relatively easily, I'm sure that the same strategy will go well for night six. And if it doesn't, well, thankfully I got the internet. So you know what? I'm going to go ahead and give night six a go and uh, knock this out. So let's do it. Gotta remember to keep that camera on Freddy. nearby. Alright, Foxy's still in his cave. Is cold. Foxy's still in his cove. Keep Foxy at bay and keep Freddy on the stage. Guys, this strategy totally works. I really want to beat this. Come on guys, there you go. Alright, Bonnie's out. Foxy's coming out of his cave. All 
All right, so this one's gonna be a little tight. So I'm at 3 a.m. and I'm a little under 50%. Which means that I cannot afford to mess this up. I had a little bit of wiggle room at night five. This one, I don't think I am. I'm gonna run out of power. That's for certain. That is for sure the thing that is going to happen. So just keep doing what I'm doing. Guys, I can't tell you how good it feels to finally have a strategy that I know that is going to work. If you're new to this game, I would recommend trying this strategy on, like, easier nights. That way... Sorry, I paused out there for a second because I'm, I'm just, I'm just, I'm so laser focused on this. All right, Foxy's is still in this place. I'll probably check Foxy again like around like 5 a.m. Sorry, I'm just, I'm so in the zone. Once you're really in the zone, you can't stop because this one has to be perfect. It has to be, or else I'm not gonna make it. Bonnie keeps creeping up on my door. Check Foxy, okay. Alright. This is gonna be tight, guys. This one's gonna be tight. Checking Foxy now. Alright, Foxy's good. Honestly, I'm not gonna check Foxy anymore. Oh no. Guys, I don't know if we're gonna make it. Alright, 5 a.m. We gotta be laser fast. Guys, I think we're gonna make it. All right. There's a chance, guys. I'm, I'm feeling good about this. I think it's possible to make it. Oh no. Oh, this guy's early. Freddy, come on. Yes! Woo! Oh, oh yeah. After failing so many times, good job, you earned some overtime. So overtime? I get paid the same amount in overtime for one night? That's this is a weird pay structure. 
And now we have Custom Night. Okay. I'm curious to see how this goes. Well, actually, I already know how this goes. Let's go to Custom Night. Nice. Nice. So, we get to, in this level, we get to set the AI level. I am going to do the easiest level for all of them. Set them all on number one. Better yet, do I, should I just do zero? Hmm. I don't know. If I put them on zero, does that mean that they do anything at all? Will something like glitch or something? I don't know. Let's do it. Let's just do it the easiest level. Let's do it. What could go wrong? Maybe we'll find some, like, Easter eggs. Because that's the thing, like, I haven't come across too many Easter eggs in this game. I really haven't. We can kind of just explore the area. We're just chilling. Just a nice, easily chill. Nobody's moving. Foxy's not moving. Freddy's not moving. Chica's not moving. Bonnie's not moving. Which is how it should be. And which is how it would, would be in normal life. I wonder what happens if I were to just close all the doors. Because I don't really see how I could lose. The AI is set at zero. I don't know. That's a very good question. If I just used up all my power, would I even lose? If the AI was set to zero. Would I even get three stars? Nothing's gonna happen. That's the thing that I'm curious about. If the game... If I do this on zero, it means that the animatronics don't do anything. So, will I still, like, will the game, will it still count if I have it all on zero? That's a very interesting question. I'm not sure. But I guess we'll just have to wait and see. Rooms. I think I did see one thing where it was like Freddy was sort of like hiding in the ladies room being creepy see here's an easter egg right here this is where all the masks stare right at you There's another Easter egg where it looks like Freddy's like literally pulling off his head. Let me see if I can find some more. Oh, there's a golden Freddy Easter egg. I think that's what happens when you 
it'll show up on here, and then there'll be like a giant golden Freddy suit. And unless you switch the camera, it'll jump out at you and crash your whole game. So, I guess while we wait for everything to end, I guess I, um, I guess I might as well just use this time to sum up my uh, thoughts on this game, since this, this is, like, kind of the conclusion. Overall, this game is pretty good. It's not bad. I understand why this franchise is so popular. I think this is a very creative concept. It's very good. It's very unique onto like any other oh wait what they're moving that doesn't make sense how are they moving i set the ai to zero why are they moving that is weird is the game gonna like try and set me up well, they, well, if I beat this, they better give me three stars at that point, because... They... I guess all zeros, technically... It doesn't necessarily mean that they don't do anything at all. I guess zero doesn't mean inactive. I guess zero just means, like, lowest level. But they are doing something. They are moving, so... Yeah, I mean, okay. So I guess that answers that question. But yeah, anyways, I think this game is pretty good. It does seem... It's all about strategy. It's all about strategy and not letting the fear get to you. Because once you get super scared, rationale goes out the window and... You're never going to learn how the characters move. I do think that a lot to this game really is just chance. A lot of it is chance. Oh, there you are, Bonnie. Okay. Dang, I almost lost that. I almost lost that. <laughs> Alright, well... Alright, well... I hope the game doesn't set me up. Chica's there. So we should be fine. Alright, Bonnie. Bonnie, you gotta go. Bonnie, you gotta leave, man. Well, it doesn't matter. It's 5 a.m. and I'm at 17%. You know what? Just stay there, Bonnie. Join the party. The more the merrier. I might as well just leave that door closed. Foxy's coming out. I'm sure he'll come running up towards my door. Alright, 6 a.m., come on. It's time. I did not think that Bonnie was gonna come up to my door like that. I really didn't. There we go. 
Custom Knight number seven complete. Notice of termination. I am fired. Tampering with animatronics. General unprofessional unprofessionalism plus odor. What are they saying that I don't shower? Oh, they only gave me two stars. They never gave me three stars. Come on. I guess I just had it on too much of an easy mode. I guess I gotta up the challenge a little bit if they're gonna give me three stars. I don't know. Let's see. But if we want a challenge, let's bump it up to 20, 20, 20. 20. Now, I don't know the strategy for this. I really don't. I'm going to make an educated guess and say that it's pretty much the same, I think. Same as what I've been doing before. If you keep the camera on Freddy... Now this is like the hard... If you keep the camera on Freddy... It sh you should be good to go. Alright. 2020, let's give it a go. Wait, what? Dang it. Oh, come on. Okay, yeah, I've already lost. Yep, ah, oh, dang it. Yep, I, I... That's that's way too difficult. I'm I'm not beating that. <laughs> oh my goodness. There's one more uh, Easter egg I want to try out. I want to get three stars. I want to I want to get at least three stars. So I'll set everything on like medium. Because that's what I want to do. I want to. I want to get at least three stars before I leave. Before I finish this. At least three stars. Okay. We'll try this again. We'll keep it on a low medium. The game has to give me three stars at that point. Oh dang it! Ah. Oh. Come on. No, 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 I'm not gonna end on that note. Not gonna do that. Alright. Let's go with this again. They gotta give me three stars at this point, and this time I'm gonna stay strictly to my strategy. Alright. This is it. They better give me- they better let me win this. Should be good. There we go. Come on, give me three stars, man. I want three stars. I want three stars, please. I did all three of them on medium. It's only giving me two stars. Dang it, man. What do I gotta do? Do I have to put one of them on like hard or something? Let me see.
Clear a custom night with AI set to 20. Really? Huh. Okay, well, according to this side, apparently you gotta do, like... You, got, you gotta set them all... I, I don't know if you had to do it to at least one of the AI instead of 20, but either way, it doesn't matter. You know what, um, I think, you know what, that's good enough for today. Um, probably good enough ever. <laughs> uh, there is one more Easter egg that I want to try. Um, so yeah, 1987. Apparently Golden Freddy is supposed to come out and scare you uh, when you set the AI to this. Fun little Easter egg. But other than that, yeah, um... This has been Five Nights at Freddy's. Overall, I think this is a pretty good game. Um, seems kind of rigged. Um, a lot of it's kind of based on chance, but I think it's ultimately based on strategy, which I think is good. Um, if you're a fan of this franchise, you probably already played this game, considering the fact that this is the OG. But um, yeah, I would recommend it. So. Uh, this is Joshua D. 9000 signing off saying goodbye, and as always, thank you for watching. Peace.